everyone welcome or welcome back my name is Natasha and I have been absent for a while so I am on a health and wellness and fitness journey um, and I kind of disappeared there for a while um, I didn't disappear because I was like gaining weight back though I did end up getting with some weight back shortly before I restarted this um, I'd actually been able to maintain fairly well um, I wasn't really losing and I wasn't really trying to lose per se. Um, there were some circumstances that didn't really make that very easy, um, uh, which we'll get into here in a second. So I had ended up moving and quitting my job and moving back in with my parents, essentially out of the state of Texas uh, they did not, not live in Texas so I ended up moving back in with them um, I had just gotten to a point with my old job that for my mental health for my um, emotional health for all of the things I just couldn't keep doing it um, I was just spinning my wheels and it was not a good situation um, so I needed to leave that and I finally came to that realization and did so um, but my roommate had been moving out of the apartment at the time um, and I was not gonna be able to afford the apartment by myself I didn't want some random roommate I needed a change of pace and so my parents were like I was like can I maybe <laughs> Uh, while I figure out where I'm gonna end up next they're kind of centrally located in the country so I could like move there and then as I was job searching and all the things be more centrally located for a shorter move as well as reduce some of the cost because Houston by yourself does it's hard um, even with all my side gigs uh, so I did that for a while um, which was good for certain mental health things because I was able to get away from that job and that situation which was also a whole grad school situation um, with a toxic advisor um, which I could go I could go on a rant but I'm not going to so moved back there which was good for that but it was bad for certain food issues um, which I may mostly managed to avoid, but I've gotten a fair amount. <laughs> Growing up, um, my mom did not necessarily instill the best food relationship with me. Um, I don't think she has the best food relationship herself and has therefore kind of passed on certain things. And then I get the complete opposite message from my dad. So it's it's a fun dynamic. Um, and then on top of that, anytime I mention or it seems like I'm doing things to try to either lose weight, etc., 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 my mom ends up making supportive comments um or things but they're not really supportive or helpful um so i don't ever want her to find this youtube channel i don't ever want her to find anything like that um i don't want her to know that i'm losing weight i don't tell her that i'm trying to lose weight or trying to you know any of that sort of stuff um, because she will try to be helpful um, and it's just not so I just don't want her to know um, if it happens it happens if it doesn't it doesn't which is gonna happen but I don't want her making comments and I didn't want her making comments or knowing that I had a YouTube channel that I discussed these sorts of things on and that I was trying to lose weight and so when I was home with them, I essentially was like 
exercising and doing all that sort of stuff in private, in secret. I was like secret exercising. <laughs> um, and I couldn't really do my normal exercise routine um, that I had started to develop really well back in Texas where I had been like, especially with COVID, I was waking up, I was doing yoga first thing in the morning, I was, you know, all that sort of stuff. But my mom would be up earlier than me to do, uh, to go to work. Um, and I couldn't really do yoga downstairs where she would know and if I was awake, she'd hear. So I'd have to wait until she left to try to do whatever I was trying to do. Um, Cause I just didn't want the comments. Um, so that made it hard. And then I tried to do a couple YouTubes when I was home, a couple videos, but uh, it was just, it was not easy to do um, to kind of keep the secret that I was doing it and also create content. So yeah, I didn't do that. <laughs> I pretty much didn't, I, that's pretty much why I didn't make videos. Um, the only time I did was when I was um, dog sitting. And even then, that was only sometimes. Um, that was one of the things I was doing for, for work. I mean, I still dog sit even when I have a real job. But that was kind of my main thing um, while I was job hunting. Um, but then, uh, found a new job, moved down here, uh, which has been good and bad. Um, the job position that I applied for and I got was a great fit. Um, but then <laughs> I started the job and I've had three different people in my department leave. Um, and I've gotten handed some much higher up job re report tasks that are not what I signed up for. That are a lot more of the administrative managementy side of things that are very stressful especially when i don't know what i'm doing and there's no one to tell me what to do um <laughs> and i'm just trying to figure something out to make it work um hopefully that has now also uh resolved itself and i will be more back to what i was supposed to be doing in the first place i think maybe haven't really gotten anyone new but I think the things that were on the plate that had due dates are done and so hopefully it's going to be a little bit more chill. We'll see. Um, but yeah, so that's kind of been where I've at, why I haven't really posted much, um, if at all. I think I, did, I think there was like maybe three videos for like the last year at all. I'd have to double check on that, but it was very limited. Um, I do have some footage actually left from uh, when I was back home um, that I will probably put into a video and post. Um, I've also got some vacations that I went on in that time which were fun. So that's where I've been up to and kind of what I've done. Um, and why I wasn't posting and <laughs> all of the life changes that have happened. But yep, still up to the same shenanigans, dog sitting, lots of plants, which, look at that monstera leaf. Just look at it, it's so pretty. It's hard to see against the window, but she's very pretty. I don't know if... She's so pretty. Anyway, all my plants, which you'll probably see in a lot of my videos because I just think it's kind of a pretty backdrop. Let me know if there's any more information kind of about the the move and the why I was posting anything like that if you want to uh, you can find me on Instagram etc or if you want me to elaborate on here I guess um, we can discuss potentially doing that we'll see otherwise I look back to kind of getting just to it and and hitting the ground running again I'm glad to have you guys here to help motivate me and provide a reason to go explore new areas and do new things uh, I find that to be <laughs> one of the benefits of having the community out there um, as well as just having the community out there. Um, it's great to talk to all of you and connect and I've been missing that which is partially why I'm back. Um, but yeah, I hope to, to 
get to connect with all of you. Thank you for tuning in. If you're new, thank you for returning. If you're one of my friends from before, uh, it was great to talk to y'all and see y'all and have a great day. Bye.